NFC and AFC championship games are happening on Sunday. The Super Bowl is right around the corner, and let's face it, you cannot watch the game without some good food. That's right. Joining us with Game Day Snacks, one of the official caterers for the Super Bowl and CEO and executive chef of the catering company, made by Meg, Meg Walker. Meg, good morning. Good morning to you. I love this topic. I'm a huge Rams fan. Excellent. You must be feeling so much pressure uh, to be one of the official caterers of the Super Bowl by the NFL. Can you give us more details on what you'll be doing and what you're most looking forward to? I have to tell you, this is a huge honor. It's a major career milestone to be able to serve our city and our amazing Rams, hopefully in our Super Bowl. Our whole team is just full court press to get ready for the Super Bowl. Um, and we are going to be a part of their um, business supplier connect program which is uh, bring diverse businesses in Los Angeles, which is really awesome. Um, and we're going to be a part of their tailgate. So this is going to be a real fantastic opportunity. Nice. Yeah. And it looks like you have a lot yeah. of really good stuff there with you. But let's start with uh, your mini LA street dogs. Okay, so if you have been to a game here in Los Angeles, you know that amazing signature um, odor, smell, amazingness of those hot dogs. On so They sell them on the street. I call them L.A. Street Dogs, and this is my version of it. And today I wanted to show you how to make it at home, which is super fun, um, and it's really, really easy. So you can also have this signature treat at home while you're watching the game. Um, so what I do is I take um, a hot dog. I know this doesn't sound super fancy, but it's great. You get a hot dog and cut them down to mini hot dog size like this and take a strip of bacon. And if you can get like thick applewood smoked bacon, that's the best. And just kind of roll this right here um, and then get them all into a nice pan. Get that warm. And bacon starts sizzling right away. Now, this is the signature smell that's going to get everybody into the kitchen. It pulls people <laughs> off the street there. It's amazing. And I've got a bunch of them all ready to go as well. So we're going to do the magic of television and put all of our L.A. street dogs right here into the pan. And it'll take a second here to scare them off. The other really great signature piece of this is that they have these great buns and I just get these at the store and I trim down like what you would call a regular dinner roll and I trim off the sides and trim down the middle and you make yourself a mini hot dog oh. bun. Um, and I will tell you that if you make these, you will be like the most amazing host. <laughs> and then I toast them off in butter. And the other fantastic part of this dish is making a shishito pepper relish. So I use um, lovely farmer's market shishito peppers, and those are really great signature here in Los Angeles. And I chop them down um, to little, basically little slices here. And I add a little bit of tamari, some scallions, and yummy um, white, sorry, white wine vinegar. And it turns into this great relish that you put on top of the hot dog. Oh. Um, so you don't with the shishitos. You don't you don't blister the shishitos first. You just do them raw. Yeah, I put them into a pan. A lot of times people are, get really intimidated by those peppers yeah. and having to blister them. Right. So this is a great recipe. You can do in easy in a soft pan and add a couple of very simple ingredients, and you have a super flavorful um, relish. Okay. All right. Let's get yeah. to something else. Yeah. Uh, how about the uh, the mini uh, the poke? Things that you have? Tacos. Ahi. <laughs> That's okay, things. I love yeah. it. Okay, <laughs> let me give you a little secret about LA. We do 600 events a year. We cater high end events. And Angelinos love their ahi tuna. It's the best, best part. Yes, we do. So, and I they do. love their tacos too. Yes, exactly. So we have ahi tuna po poke tacos, and they nice. go into gorgeous yeah. wonton shells with an eel sauce. And they're fantastic with some scallions. These go like hotcakes. So if you can, head over to one of our amazing Asian markets, and they have beautiful tuna that you can easily cut up. You don't have to do anything fancy, and suddenly you've got ahi poke tacos. Wow. I wish you yes, were in I the got studio a couple with other us. Fun dishes here for you. <laughs> Everything looks I know, amazing. Anytime. I'll come on down. Excellent. Thank, Thank you. you so much for joining us this morning. Uh, for more info on Meg Walker and her local catering company, Made by Meg, you can go to mbmcatering.com or follow her on Instagram. Thanks so much for joining us.